Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is L. Today I'll be taking you through the steps on how to easily create professional online courses and digital products. And you can do this even if you are just starting out using one AI powerful tool called Wondershare Demo Creator. All right, now before we start, what is Demo Creator? Demo Creator is an all-in-one screen recorder and video editor trusted by educators, students, course creators, and even YouTubers like you and me. I leave links to Demo Creator in the description. Once you click on that link, it's going to take you to their website. Now, let's start off with why you need a good screen recorder for your content or for creating courses or for digital products. When you are creating online courses, it's not just about recording your screen. You need some smooth, epic edits, clear voice quality like the quality of my voice, good visuals, and the best part about this is that you need to save time doing it. That's where Wondershare Demo Creator comes in. Let me show you how it works. The first thing that we're going to dive in is recording your online courses with Demo Creator. First off, the recording features are super powerful. Let's start with teleprompter. Stay on script without memorizing. Your text grows on screen while you record your videos. Let me show you how it works. All right, so to use that teleprompter, I'm going to select video recorder and right from here, I'm going to select camera. You can see at the bottom of the screen, we have the teleprompter tool right there. You can click on that. I'm going to copy a script that I have right here and then paste it in there. So control C or you right click and click on copy. Right here, you can paste it by clicking control V and this is the script. You can simply click on the play option or you can improve the writing by AI if you want to. And you can simply also import if you have it in a test file. All right. You can select import and then select it in a test file. You can simply click on play to play the script. And as it rolls on the screen, you can watch it directly on the screen. If you have a camera connected to your PC, then you read from it. Magic tools like Kerza highlights makes your mouse movement epic, which is quite perfect for YouTube tutorials and online courses. All right, so to access the magic tool, we are going to click on video recorder and right from here, I am then going to select screen and I am going to record a screen. So I can adjust the ratio right here. And that is all I need for the tutorial. And so I'm going to select magic tools, which is the star icon there. We have smart zoom which will automatically add zoom animations to where you click or move the mouse cursor. All right, we also have cursor highlights, which you add a little color to your uh, mouse cursor when you are recording your video. All right, you can select from these colors. We have red, blue, violet, and then yellow. You can turn that on. We have show keys. We have AI voice cleaner if you be recording your voice across the tutorial like how I'm doing. You can click on record and right from here, it's gonna take three seconds for the recording to start and you can record your course or your video or your tutorial. And then once you're done, you can simply close it and then take a look at how the recording went. I'm then gonna click on play and you can see that the smart zoom and the Kesa highlights are all working in this video and this will help your video stand out from other creators. All right, so this is how we use the smart effects you can simply click on export to export voice cleaner demo creator ai systems automatically remove background noise keeping your audio crystal clear and by the way that is what i used for this video right from here i'm going to select video recorder and mm -hmm. i am then going to select audio all right so i can then record my voice right here if i have a professional microphone connected to it or if i'm simply using the microphone on the computer so i'm going to click on record and right from here, I'm recording my voice. Once you're done recording your voice, you can simply click on stop right here. We can then proceed by selecting advanced editing and select recordings right here. There is a video that we recorded. And so right from here, I'm going to click on it and then add to timeline by clicking on a plus sign right there. And the audio will be added to the timeline. I'm going to select this audio and right from here, I'm then going to select audio effect. You can see AI voice cleaner and I'm then going to click and drag it onto the audio and you can see a green sign on the audio which means that we have cleaned the noise in our audio or the background noise in the audio. You can also do the same for videos as well. To do the same for a video, all you have to do is to simply import the video, add the video to the timeline and then drag and drop the AI voice cleaner onto the video and it will be done for you. It's as simple as that. And a smart zoom feature, which lets the demo creator automatically zoom in on an important action to keep the audience focused or hooked. 
All right, so to use the smart zoom effects, I'm going to click on video recorder and right from here, I'm then going to select screen. Once you select screen, it will give you this option right here. And I'm going to select the option right here and you can see smart zoom. So you might want to enable it for the smart zoom effect to take place. A video recording look cool and epic by zooming in on areas where you move the mouse cursor or click. Once you have it enabled, you can click on record. It takes three seconds for the video to start recording and right from here, it is going to record the screen and then zoom in at specific areas where you click or move the mouse cursor. There is a preview of it. You can see that the mouse cursor is zooming in on certain areas on the screen. All right, so that is how the smart zoom works. Let's also talk about editing your course video in Demo Create. After recording, editing inside Demo Creator is just easy and powerful. The first tool we'll be using is audio effect, which lets you enhance your voiceovers. To do this, I'm then going to select video editor. This is where we'll be editing all the videos. I am going to import a video right here and I'm going to drag it to the timeline. I'm going to keep settings and then drag it to the beginning Most of the timeline. Most people who die in the... This is the video. And so what we're going to do is click on audio effect. And here we have AI voice cleaner, AI denoise, AI voice changer, AI vocal remover, and then voice effect. I am then going to try out one of these ones by selecting it and dragging it onto the video in a timeline. So I selected AI voice changer right from here. You could see that there are a bunch of natural voices here that you can select from. I'm going to select Amy. Wondershare, creativity simplified. Now, once you like Amy, you can select Amy and click on OK and the AI voice changer effect will take place and change the voice of the original character in the video. All right, which is very simple. You can also use AI vocal remover by dragging it and putting it on the video, which is quite simple to do. Another thing we'll be talking about is Kesa effects, which allows you to highlight clicks and movement for cleaner or clearer tutorials. The next thing we're taking a look at is Kesa effect, where we select Kesa effect on the video. And right here, you can see a bunch of effects here. Kesa highlights, Kesa spotlights, Kesa magnify, Kesa rings and click sound. To use some of these Kesa highlights, we need a recorded video in Demo Creator. So let's click on record and right from here, you can record the screen. So I'm going to record the screen. I'm going to select the ratio and then click on record right here. The video is going to be recorded. Now I'm intentionally going to click on some areas on the screen for the video to be recorded and right from there, I am going to show you how this whole thing works. All right. Once I'm done, I am then going to close the recording and this is a preview of it. So from there, I'm going to click on advanced editing and it's going to bring it to the media file. I'm going to drag it and import it onto the timeline. And right from here, you can select Kesa effect and select a bunch of them right here. Now, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to click on one of the Kesa effects, which is Kesa magnifier, drag it onto the timeline and leave it there. You can see that the magnifier is, has been applied on the screen or on the preview screen. You can disable it by clicking Ctrl Z to undo it. And here you go. You can add other effects as well if you do want it. Another thing that we can also talk about is the pan and zoom. Which brings dynamic movement to your lessons, keeping students engaged. To do this, we are then going to import a video that we recorded onto the timeline. And right from here, we can select pan and zoom. Now the pan and zoom effect allows you to pan and zoom in on specific areas on the screen when you are recording a video. All you have to do is to click on the effect and then drag it onto the video in the timeline. They have a bunch of options here that you can select from. So smart zoom. Once you can drag it and put it on a video, it's going to apply the smart zoom effect. You see, applying smart zoom will replace, will replace all the animations. Click on OK and you can see that once you preview it here, the smart zoom will take effect right here. So that is how we use the pan and zoom option in Wondershare Demo Creator. You can adjust it and play around with it as to how it best suits you. We're going to talk about annotations as well, like arrows, test, and highlights, which makes your explanation super clear and epic. To do this with a video imported, you are going to select annotations. And here we have a bunch of annotations here, arrow, oval, box, square, and then I'm going to select arrow. Now, once you select arrow to be added to the timeline as a new timeline, and right here, once I click on play, it's going to preview on the screen. Now. Let's say you want to point out something in your course or in your tutorial. You can use it by 
increasing the size or dragging it you can also rotate it to the specific location in which you want to point that specific object on the screen all right so there are a bunch of them you have 3d and then 2d annotations here you could select from them you can also add text in annotation section by selecting the text option right there it also has an auto subtitle feature which can generate captions automatically for you which is essential for accessibility and reaching a wider audience in different countries another thing we're going to take a look at is auto subs which automatically add subtitles by clicking on that option here and to do that we can import subtitles manually add them or click on auto subtitles to add them once you click on it it's going to ask you to select a language and i'm speaking english in a video and then click on start to start transcribing and then adding captions to the video once the caption is ready you can edit the font and change it as to how you want it if you want an in-depth tutorial on how to use these features into detail then leave it down in the comment section i'll make a full tutorial on this to help you guys learn how to use wondershare demo creator now there are a bunch of new game changing effects on Wondershare Demo Creator. And if you're on Windows, Demo Creator just got even better. These are some new features that it has on the Windows version. Batch Export. Perfect if you are making multiple lessons, which gives you the accessibility to export all your videos at once. It also has an LSAT subtitle export. This allows you to create subtitles inside Demo Creator, then export them in SRT format, which you can easily upload on your YouTube videos or on your online school platform. Another new feature about Wondershare Demo Creator is window recording. This new feature allows you to capture a single app window only, no matter what else happens on the computer screen. Another cool feature is AI test-based editing. Edit your videos simply by editing the test transcript. It automatically finds and removes silence and pauses too. Now let's talk about final thoughts about Wondershare Demo Creator. So whether you are building your first online course, recording tutorials for YouTube or selling digital products, Wondershare Demo Creator gives you everything you need without the heavy price tag of other tools like Camtasia. Check out the link in the description to try out Demo Creator today. And if you want more tutorials like this, don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up and comment below if you have any questions about creating your own online course.